Hi guys, this algorithm here is a warm-up algorithm from HackerRank, and this challenge is called Staircase. So here they're going to give us a number like this, number four, and then we have to print the hash symbol a certain number of times uh, to get what looks like a staircase. So one thing to keep in mind is that in this challenge, the base here, like you can see there are four hash symbols here, is the same as the height. So four vertically and also four at the bottom. They give us another example here. Um, so they pass here the number six, that's going to be the inputs. And then here at the bottom, you can see that we have six times the hash symbol and also vertically six uh, symbols, but it looks like a staircase where every symbol is aligned to the right. So we have to write the code for this challenge. So here in this main function, they have an int variable. So it stores a certain value from the inputs. And then they are just going to pass that value to a function called staircase. And that function is what we need to complete here. So I'm going to switch my view and I'm going to start coding. It's going to be super simple. We only need two lines of code. So I want to go with a good old uh, for loop. I want to start i at one, and then I want to go all the way to n inclusive at the end. So because it's a single statement that I need to write here, I don't need to add the uh, curly brackets. So I can simply go to the next line like that. And then now I can say C out. And the first thing that I want to do is make sure that here, when I print my uh, results, I get something that looks like a half matrix, uh, kind of that way. You see how the end is well aligned vertically. So I'm going to set the width here to N. So this means that from this point, we're going to get uh, the width if this prints line by line, it's going to be like six by six like that. The next thing that I want to do is make sure that I set the padding. I want to set the alignment to the right. So in C++, you have something called right. And uh, by the way, set width here. This is from um, the IO manip header, but because we have this header at the top, it's already part of it. So you can see that here, line by line, we print different numbers or different amounts of symbols. The first line is one, then two, then three, and it increments, just like our i value here. So in C++, you can use the uh, string, like a string constructor, and determine how many characters you want to display. So let's say you want to display something once, you could do something like this, once, and I want to print that hash symbol only once, or twice or three times or four times and etc. In this case, we want to print the hash symbol i times, meaning that at the first iteration, we are printing it once, at the second iteration, we are printing it twice, and then so on. But at every iteration, like when we are done printing, let's not forget to go to the next line. So at the first line, we're going to get this symbol only one. Then at the second line, we're going to get two of them, then three of them, then four of them, then five, and then six. And at every iteration, they're going to be pushed to the right. So we have the right amount of hash symbols pushed to the right, and they are controlled by this set width right here. And we just pass the test cases. So that's it for this HackerRank challenge. If you liked it, please make sure you subscribe, turn on your notifications. I try and post challenges every day. Um, I try my very best. So please support this channel by subscribing, and I'll catch you next time. Bye.